Are you a beginner, intermediate, or advanced strummer? How can you even tell? Why should you even care? We're going to talk about those things and more coming up. Hey, I'm Nate Savage, and me and my wife Chelsea run GuitarFam.com, where it's our mission to help you play the music you love with the people you love. And as we, you know, run the site from day to day, doing private lessons, creating courses, doing live streams, we meet a lot of different guitar players from all around the world, you know, that have varying skill levels of strumming. And you know, it's it's no wonder because strumming is so critical. Think about it; it's really half of the way you express yourself on the guitar. I heard it said uh, once that your left hand is what you know and your right hand is who you are and I think that's really true and since strumming is that important I think it's worth investing the time to get as good as you can and knowing where you stand as far as strumming can give you some perspective so you know exactly what it is that you need to work on or it might even you know expose you to some new techniques that you didn't even know existed and once you have that big picture laid out in front of you it could be much easier to focus on the things that you need to work on to take your strumming to that next level. It's gonna help you play the music you want, be a more dynamic strummer, and get your musicianship to that level that you want. But you know, how do you even tell if you're a beginner, intermediate, or advanced strummer? It's not like piano or violin where they have you know those graded courses worldwide where you can kind of get a really good idea of what level you're at. Well, things like the ability to play through an entire song, the ability to figure out strumming patterns by ear, the ability to come up with your own strumming patterns, the ability to um, you know use dynamic elements in your strumming patterns to make them more interesting, and your timing are all elements of playing guitar that you can use to kind of assess your strumming. But you know sometimes as a beginner or just somebody with less experience, we don't even know what we don't know, and that can make it hard to see where you are on that spectrum from you know very beginner all the way to advanced and it can make it even more difficult to know what to work on. To help you with this, we've created a quiz called the Strumming Evaluation Quiz, and it's a quick 10 question quiz that will help you determine if you're a beginner, advanced beginner, intermediate, or advanced strummer. Just go to guitarfam.com slash strumming quiz to take it, and as soon as you finish it, you'll be emailed your results with some details on how to progress and a short list of lessons that will help you get to that next level of strumming as fast as possible. Our goal with this is to give you some insights on where you are on that global strumming skill and give you some steps so you can get to that next level. Now, if you have any questions as you take the quiz or just about strumming in general, you can always email us support at guitarfam.com or just leave a comment below this video wherever you're watching it. Okay, that's it for this video. I know this one is a little bit different for the channel, but again, go to guitarfam.com slash strumming quiz to take the quiz today. See you.